Reedy, you join us in the recovery room and there's a bit to talk about this week. Uh, can we start with Michael Hibbert, who's a bit sore? Yeah, Michael uh, tightened up in his hamstring uh, last weekend, and a weekend before last, sorry. And uh, unfortunately, he's got a low hamstring uh, and it's a minor tear there. Uh, because it's low, uh, they often can play on, which he did for a quarter, um, and then just tightened up. So he's going to miss a couple of weeks, uh, probably three from the incident. Um, that, that's not great news, but some more positive news uh, on Tom Bell Chambers um, and his likely return this week. Yeah, uh, uh, Tommy's uh, doing very well. We backed him off for a couple of weeks and he's back into full training and he'll full train today. Where, so that's four days out um, and he will play unless something untoward happens, so that's good. That's really good news. Uh, Marty Gleeson, another one that's likely to come back? Uh, Marty Gleeson was just having uh, low-grade tendonitis for four to five weeks, uh, so we took a conservative approach and we expect him to play uh, this week and train fully today. That's really good news. Uh, and then I guess there's the two, two uh, major injuries we've got at the moment in Joe Danaher and, and his clavicle, and how's that recovering? Uh, Joe's an interesting one because he uh, uh, did a training and he's got an underspaced fracture. Um, however, uh, Greg Hoy plated that for us uh, because then they can play at four weeks. So approximately you'll miss another two after this week. Um, Joe Watson, the other one, how's he recovering? Uh, He's still, still on track? Yeah, Joe's on track uh, with a rectus femoris repair. Uh, that's a power muscle, so it's powerful things pull on that tendon. So at this stage he can run uh, nearly flat out, uh, but we don't take him off the mark, we don't kick him long on that side, and uh, we expect him to play the last two games, and uh, possibly if uh, Julian Fellows really happy with him in a couple of weeks, he may play the last three. We saw his meeting with Julian on the hangar last week, and, and he sort of touched on that he could start kicking. Has he begun doing a little bit to that now? Yeah, yeah, he has, but obviously... Uh, you don't go out and kick a 50 metre bomb because that's exactly what would pull on that tendon whereas he's kicking with a bent knee uh, short distances already he's done that uh, the weekend no pain whatsoever perfect ready thanks for the update thanks